hi guys welcome to my channel enterprise security this video will be a continuous video of my previous Cisco ice project if you miss my previous videos links are available in the description today we are going to discuss and learn about Cisco ice and licenses how to claim the license and, and, and apply these licenses on Cisco ice before start this video please subscribe my channel and press the like button if you like this video let's get started suppose as a customer you order some security and network devices from a Cisco this order contain Cisco licenses as well so first you will install and configure these devices but you have to install permanent license before put these devices in a production so here is some confusion come into the picture for the past few years I observed that most of the con customers are a bit confused about how to claim licenses and how to apply these licenses on applies when Cisco deliver these devices at the same time they will send you the software license claim certificate let me repeat software license claim certificate I will show you how it looks like okay if you come here you will they will send you the e-delivery so let's check the ISAPEX okay so it will look like this so this will be a software license claim certificate it contain product name it contain quantity of your licenses it contain product authorization key in short form PAK it will be a 11 digit number and it contain pin number as well and it contain order number as well okay so this information will help you to register your license so before we move on let me give you some basic information if you have Cisco devices in your environment or if you order some Cisco devices most of the time you will use near about three sites some friendly sites from Cisco one is software download for sure if you wanted to download the softwares and security patches you will use software download second one it's smart software licenses if you wanted to download your licenses and apply to your devices you will you will use that site the third one is traditional licensing suppose if you have still you have old devices which are uh, which are working on the traditional licenses so you can use this site so let me show you here so first of all you have to go software at cisco.com you will be landed here so this is a software download you click here and you can download your software this is smart software licensing so nowadays all devices are supporting smart software licenses okay and this is a traditional licenses let me click on soft, smart software licenses and log in with my account sorry I just click traditional licenses okay so you will land it here product registration license so here you can register your product so once you click here add new device or new PAK token you just need to select one token which you can find it here the product authorization key PA key okay just insert that PA key click OK then here you want it you need to put the pin number then this product will register on this side once that product get registered you can see that product um, in this I I here in your PAK and token device list so you can 
you can create a PAK file for a traditional licensing or you can move that license to your smart account or your virtual account so let me log in to my another account and let me show you my virtual account licenses okay so I'm going to log in my another smart account okay the smart software licensing so in inventory if you if you can see here licenses for instance I cannot see the ice licenses here okay so that means these devices are still in legacy licenses so I can convert my licenses to the smart account so what I can do I can simply go here convert to the smart account I can simply click here convert the smart licenses default next convert licenses PAK has successfully converted to smart software licenses added to the virtual account default okay so I can go here in inventory in licenses again I guess search here I s it will take some time to see that let me open the all see the base licenses you can see now okay so let's convert another licenses into the smart account okay so these are the licenses we will select one by one these are the plus licenses <coughs> click convert licenses convert to the smart account click on this is ice uh, plus licenses um, the, the destination virtual account will be default click next convert licenses your pack has been successfully converted to the smart software license and added to the virtual account default same thing for other accounts sorry for other licenses select pack oh, this is a different license so that's uh, apex license convert to the smart license select the license this is pack session 300 licenses next convert license same message okay so we can go here inventory licenses we can see our all license ice licenses here now see the apex license base license and plus license these licenses are in are available in virtual account defaults okay let's log into the Cisco eyes okay so uh, we have logged into the Cisco eyes we have to go to the administration and licensing so currently we are using uh, the evaluation licenses it's uh, have 165 counts 140 f 114 for plus licenses there is no apex licenses so what we can do we can go inside uh, the smart licenses we have to put here registration token and mode 
okay so first we need to generate the registration token okay so let's go to the license token description yes. this So we'll put 365 days. Maximum count is 1200. Okay, create token. So we can copy this token. Okay, we can come here. put this registration token select HTTP direct and click register are you sure you want to, to register you can see the masses are you sure you want to register smart license yes so it will take some time to register this device license registration will take some time after few minutes you can see this device <coughs> the licenses are are registered if you go back to the uh, smart license portal you can see here I'm on the Cisco smart license uh, smart software licensing so you can see here the apex and base and uh, ice plus licenses out of 1200 and 900 one one six license are uh, licenses are used and one seventy three licenses are used. So if you see here one one six one sixty five one one four this will be uh, like a changing uh, so it will take some time to replicate with uh, these licenses but it's 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 hundred percent sure that this license this device is registered with the smart licenses um, and uh, now yeah you can see this last author authorization date today is uh, Jan 28 2021 so this licenses are uh, compliant so if you click here a refresh it will keep register it, it will keep refresh the count of the use licenses so now apex there is no any feature used now for the apex so once that feature is used uh, you can see you can see the li license count will be increased so hope you understand these things how to apply the licenses and how to claim the licenses so hope this video will uh, informative for you thank you for watching this video